feature, just like they, you know, you can't type libstool into the comments at barstool.com. Right. But yeah, I think libstool is one. Is that of really true? Things. I've heard that. I don't know. That can't be true. I don't know if it's true. Hey, uh, Greg, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> That's a man who did not expect to be on. He almost sounds a little bit like Walt Jr. When you call, <laughs> when you call the number, they answer, put you on. You should expect them to speak. And they're like, Ugh. that Clay Travis tube was actually pretty good yesterday. About free free Hong Kong, he, he, he cannot. You cannot type free Hong Kong in the back of a shirt. Yeah, I actually tried <laughs> right. it. I, so here's the thing. I almost tweeted this out, but I thought it was too uh, uh, infantile. You can free free Long Dong, but you can't free Hong uh, Kong. There you go. <laughs> but those two infantile? <laughs> <laughs> we can get a game of ping pong going. <laughs> you can free ping pong. So bizarre. You can free ding dong. <laughs> but that, that means that somebody made the decision within the like the coding architecture, just like they, you know, you can't type libstool into the comments at barstool.com. Somebody made the decision that free Hong Kong was going to be specifically prohibited from any jersey. Um, right. Oh, you but, can't type libstool into the... Th really? Oh, yeah. There are some words that are banned in the comment section. At well, I know I know there are certain ones that are banned, like, you know... Oh, slurs and stuff. Right. But yeah, I think libstool is one. Is that, that really true? true? I've heard that. I don't know. That can't be true. I don't know if it's true or not. Yeah, I've, 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 I've heard, heard people that, DM me and say that their, their comments went missing. Yeah, I've had that too. That's embarrassing. Really? Yeah. yeah. That's fucking ridiculous. But anyways, they've reversed course now. So, I mean... Well, not Barstool. No, not Barstool. Right. Uh, the NBA. So now, I mean, I've, is anybody really actually ordering a free Hong Kong jersey? But oh God, no, no. The last thing, the last thing any basketball fans care about is that. I mean, just, just to get NBA games to play. <laughs> Jesus, I mean, I bet, I that was. They'll probably they'll probably sell more uh, all cops are bastards or kill cops jerseys oh, than they will free Hong Kong. It was interesting because I listened to a little of uh, Pardon My Take yesterday, and they were kind of saying that they're like a lot of the people arguing this like don't actually care about the issue, which is true to some extent, but that doesn't change what's happening really yeah, I mean, like I'm some of the people are just arguing to be assholes on twitter or whatever but that I mean, doesn't change I'm not, we, I, we, I, we I, I mean how much does pft really care about the black lives matter movement right is he just doing it to grandstand yes you know i, I, I don't so, know that but i'm just but, saying like well i'm just saying we we talk, to say that we talk right. about it quite often when we talk about the nba or any kind of you know geopolitics i mean we're not doing fundraisers for it we're not on missions to china we're not trying to rescue uyghurs from captivity so i guess i mean i don't know how much yeah, do I we mean, care about it yeah it's well, I, I I agree, but I think it's an interesting study of hypocrisy. That's all. Yeah. Am, I, am I flying out there to solve? No, I mean, but but you know, I mean, do we is, think Ellie Schnitt really cares about the criminal say, justice is, system is, is, or is PFT sold all his you know things and he's moved into a neighborhood and is he stopped doing his podcast and dedicated his life to the Black Lives Matter movement? Oh, he's in like he's, he's in like so. chapter. My knowledge. Or is he's, doing he's on chapter thirteen of white fragility. Yeah, I mean, you know, I mean, it's. <laughs> Any other calls of note, Steve? Uh, yeah, uh, penis head Chris called into EI yesterday. <laughs> penis head Chris. They panic at the yeah. last second. Hello, Chris. <laughs> hey, uh, Greg, how you doing? Hold on, hold on, hold on. First of all, listen, I've got, uh... It's nerve-wracking. You don't think... You, when you call EI, you don't think they're going to take your call. I understand. It is, uh, the love boat. <laughs> ah, 1982. And, uh... You can so, tell he kind of thought he was supposed to say it's a uh, Johnny Carson. Yeah, here. I was expecting. <laughs> so the minute fans were like, "Oh no!" Uh, Chris and Ken immediately recognized his voice, and that's why they dropped him. I thought that they heard his voice. They were like, "This guy's screwing up his voice to do some kind of impression or right. something." That's his natural voice. Yes, <laughs> and his natural head too. They yes. panic at the yeah. last second. Hello, Chris. <laughs> Hey, uh, Greg, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> it's almost like that's, I mean, that's that he was on with you the other night. That's not really his now. He sounds different than that when you're talking to him. Uh, uh, but that yeah, is, yeah, that is, but that's pretty Carson up, though. You're almost expecting a little bit Carson right there. Yeah, he doesn't sound like that all the time. Yeah, what do you, what do you think, Ed? Well, uh, <laughs> hello, Chris. Weird stuff. <laughs> hey, uh, Greg, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> That's a man who did not expect to be on. He almost sounds a little bit like Walt Jr. When you call, <laughs> when you call the number, they answer, put you on. You should expect them to speak. And they're like, Ugh. he sounds like George Takei. Oh, a little bit, yeah. Hello, hello, Greg. How are you doing? Oh, Chris. oh you. <laughs> hey, oh my. Hey, how you doing? Big fan. What's up, Chris? <laughs> Stop. See, the thing is, that's a, that's a tell. <laughs> you never ah. tell. No one's a big fan of Greg. All right, what are you? What's your deal, pal? Even Greg sounds. Greg sounds disgusted by that. I'm not Say, buying it. Saying you're a big fan of Greg Hill is like when someone calls this show and says, "Big gearhead." Yeah. Here. Uh, all right. What's happening? Here? Yeah, I just like that Greg Hill thing. Go ahead. For a second. 
Because Greg sounds it's just so dis- it's like like fuck off. Like please don't tell you. No one's a fan of mine. Stop. People drive to work. Hey, Greg, uh, how you doing? Big fan. Hold What's on. Up? Hold on. Get some George the K, would you please? <laughs> it's a great old Stern prank call. Uh, before George Takei was Takei? Takei. He says yeah, I've heard of both of Takei. Yeah. Takei. <laughs> they, they called in a, they did a prank call where they said they were Ricardo Montalban. They were, do you ever hear that or no? I don't think so. He's like, Ricardo, <laughs> how are you? My favorite uh, George Takei <laughs> moment was uh, when Artie came out to him. No, that was great. He didn't realize he was so recording. He's so like, yeah, I'm gay. I'm so happy for you. <laughs> Macho. <laughs> <laughs> An engaging human being. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's go back to uh, to uh, penis head Chris, please. Hello, Chris. <laughs> hey, uh, Greg. Uh, how you doing? Big fan. The beep. I'll give him this. The beep is jarring. Like it just beeps uh, and then yeah, you're like, yeah, oh, shit, yeah, I'm yeah, on here. What, what, what is he? He sounds like he's. I don't know. That doesn't. Molesters and killers should be put to death. <laughs> I think maybe he was debating. Do I do a voice? Or does that immediately get me dropped? I think he was in the midst of a debate. You do the always smart thing, which is to kind of do both. Ah, and yeah. Ooh, Greg, how are you? We'll start by saying I'm a fan of yours. It no, sounds I, very that's, genuine. That's when you know you're right. It sounds very genuine. Hey, uh, Greg, how you doing? Big fan. What's up, Chris? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get this over with. I mean, I don't mean this against Greg. I, I, I really have no individual problem with Greg. But nobody's a big fan of his. <laughs> like it, he, he would tell you that, I think. Big I'm fan. sure he wouldn't. What's up, Chris? He's just trying to make a living. <laughs> Stop bothering the show. We're that is, bothering. Chris, Steve's right, though. That's how, when you get a call that says, like, I'm a big gearhead. I'm like, all right, let's go. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> let's get to the bottom of this. <laughs> yeah, so I, I have a question about uh, Cam Newton, but before I do. About uh, Cam Newton? Before. Why do you hang ahead? What? 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 What's Where going on? Did we lose him? Nope. Oh, must have dropped now, now, of course, nope, that's, that's, that's the weirdest when he get, he's like, oh, what? What's that's on Cam? That, Cam? What, what <laughs> name are you say? That's not Greg because hey, Sulu. I, I, I've been in that chair. Like you know, when the person's on the phone, like where where'd he go? Like what? <laughs> is this like working? Chris, like, what? Chris, where are you? <laughs> no, you gave a sign to Ken to hang up, and Ken hung up. Like no, no, no. Why can't you just say that? Like what? What are you doing? Like, Cam. So what did Chris, what did Chris say? Do we know Steve or no? No. Did no. Chris tape his call like Tim did? No, I don't think he did. Idiot. What is this? My goodness, yes. What is the name you say? Cam? Cam Newton? <laughs> Chris, I need you to. Chris, are you there? <laughs> Hello again. Let me hear Chris one more time. Hello, Chris. <laughs> Hey, uh, Greg, how you doing? Big fan. <laughs> it's worth the whole thing. What's up, Chris? <laughs> yeah, so I, I have a question about uh, Cam Newton, but before I do... About uh, Cam Newton? Before... Go ahead. Why are there, why are there pigs flying doing? in the sky above me? <laughs> why is technology failing me all around what me? What is this? Is this a, those are dogs are playing poker right in front of me? What is this one of those? I suspect that those it's telephones? much more substantial. <laughs> Is this, is this heaven? It's so creepy. What, what, Chris's name was right there. Now it's not there. Was this a sleight of hand? This is the work of, of a Mr. Copperfield or he's, Mr. Houdini? Danielle, he's caught. <laughs> We've lost him. What's the Lincoln line? He's with the gods now? What are these? He belongs to history now. He belongs to the ages. <laughs> no, no, he belongs to the ages. <laughs> he belongs to the ages. <laughs> Penis head. I mean, Chris belongs to the ages now. Ken, where did he go? Dang. What? What was that, Danielle? Dang. What? <laughs> <laughs>